I'm Nick, and I'm the creator of Fontaine, or <laughs> Four Sides Cards. Alright. Hey. Alright, so um, I'm the creator of I'm the creator of um, Four Sides Cards. Um, my deck is right here. Um, put them which is live right now on Kickstarter. Um, I also have my Instagram, which is Forsyth Cards, and my YouTube channel, which my fiance takes full control of. So if you ask me questions, we'll both answer. Um, I'm gonna go over some cards that I've, uh, that I have personally that mean a lot to me. They're not the best cardistry deck. Doesn't mean it's the best magic deck. Doesn't really matter. It's just cards that I personally love. Um, which we were talking about this morning. Um, I'll go into the first deck, which um, will be my, my verts. This is my first cardistry deck. Um, also have the summer edition right here um, with an unopened pack of verts. Um, put those back here. Uh, yeah, this was um, one of my first cardistry card decks that I learned on. Um, just really means a lot to me because it was kind of like, you know, I did all a bunch of research. I was like, what is the best cardistry card? And this one happened to be all at everyone's top of their list. So naturally I got a bird deck. So this was my, pretty much my first ever cardistry deck. Um, Let's see, another deck. I have about 400 decks. Um, about finished with my Fontaine collection, which is right here. I had started putting these up on their own little pedestal because that's when I first got into cardistry. Um, everyone talked about Fontaine, so I thought they were what you inspired to be. I went to film school and everyone wanted to be, you know, I want to be this director, I want to be that director. I wanted to be Steven Spielberg. And to me, Fontaine was like the Steven Spielberg films. It was the top of the line. Um, so I kind of put them in their own category. Another one, which is anyone, um, a huge fan of anyone, because I just, you know, the style that he puts in his cards, um, it's very minimum, which is what I kind of wanted to do with my deck. I kind of followed in his footsteps of the just the simple design um, another card to me, um, one being the Houndstooth because I'm a huge Alabama fan and this was kind of like my first anyone deck that I went with because one, I love the Houndstooth of it. Um, and, uh, really didn't, this was, I'd say this was the only anyone deck that I had at the time. Um, and then I started noticing like some, you know, something about this deck and this, um, Tobias, this creator was everything was so, something stuck out to me. It was so minimum, but it had such a powerful look to it. Um, you know, uh, this was my, another one of my first ones I had. I didn't know anything. Actually, when I got this deck, I didn't know much about anyone. It was right after I got the Houndstooth, and it was Danny Davis, why I bought it. But now, no offense to Dan Dave, I now own it because of anyone. Um, but my favorite anyone deck would just be like the one way design. I, I personally like one way designs. Um, Actually, I just really like cards in general, so it doesn't really matter to me. But if you have a one-way design, I don't lose sleep over it. Um, got that. And then I use this one, which is their newest card that they came out with, um, Human Need. So I'm a huge anyone fan. Um, anyone fan. Um, third deck I will talk about. Um, if you are still watching this video, if you're even that interested in it. Look at that look. Come on. Come here. Come here. Show the dog. Show the dog. Come here. It's Mamma Mia. Come here. Come here. Okay. 
So, the third deck I want to talk about um, is right up here. This is Mandalorian deck, which is an awesome deck. Um, or my Ace Fulton, my casinos, Ace Fulton casinos. Um, I own... <sighs> I almost have his whole collection. Some of them are a little out of my price range. And if you have a denim, cowboy denim, please message me. Um, I have his um, whole October set over here. I kind of put Brad uh, Brad Fulton, which one of the best card designers out there. He um, He's kind of been my mentor. He's been kind of the guy that's, you know, been there for me to answer any questions. Um, anything that I have had to ask about he does you know not more the kickstarter but the card design and how to sell them and what people are looking for the beauty in them and he does a lot of uh right now they're doing stuff with jackson robbins um they do youtube in the morning oh, the dawn's early light which has been really fun to watch um so anything all of brad fulton's decks but one particular <laughs> All right, decks behind decks. There's a, obviously there's a whole nother stack um, under here. Um, anything, Dan, there's some Dan and Dave's. Uh, I can, it's, it's the Finn Patel. Um, the Finn Patel. Brad Fulton, I don't where's that deck at? It's basically the opposite of this deck. Um, it's black, but the casino is... They probably know what it looks like if they're watching this video. Probably, all right. Well, I just wanna, just wanted to show it that I had it. It's somewhere in this uh, colossal stuff. So anyways, um, next deck is he's a fairly newer guy. Um, I talk to him about every single day. Um, is uh, Luke Wadey. Um, this was my first, was uh, the mono card. He's uh, just came out with a new deck that just completely crushed it on uh, Kickstarter. Um, he came out with, his story is really cool because he uh, came into the card world not knowing anything about it and created a card, actually some of the best cards out there, um, visually and, you know, just the touch and feel of them in, in any way. Um, I have a few of his, uh, which I believe he got third place with this deck on deck of the year last year. So sorry, that's hiding behind there, but I needed to clean up. Um, I have a lot of decks and I have about 15 to 20 hard on the way and all the Kickstarters that I have funded. Um, I was talking to this morning Sears, we were talking, there's his decks. I bought a couple more from him. Um, of course, um, Momentum, I love this guy. He does great. Um, I have all of his decks, there's one right there. Uh, oh, there's the Fun Patel right there. Fun. <laughs> um, he does, I, I just love, I was just messing with this deck last night. This is a great deck. Um, you know, just shooting, or sh shooting around. I love with the arrows and everything. Um, and like I said, I love all decks. It's just, these are, Again, these are particular ones that I like to, um, you know, mess with and everything. And of course, I'm a huge Fontaine fan. Um, any one fan is my bread and butter. Um, Jim and I, uh, we were talking about Superfly this morning with Jim and I. Um, God was talking about it. Uh, I got my David Blaine's right here. Um, you know, I, I started getting his decks, and I think they are his red gator back. There's a couple of them somewhere else. Um, of course, I'm a huge Chris Ramsey fan. Obviously, um, Chris, Chris Ramsey, I got right here. Chris Ramsey ever watched this, I would love a, a V1. I know he probably doesn't have any, but um, I got his decks right the V1's all I need. Um, I have his decks right here, beautiful decks. Um, I love his V2, uh, which is the black with the gold. Um, huge Chris Ramsey fan. Um, let's see, I love Jackson. 
I've got a few of his decks right here. This is decks of all deck. This is an unbelievable deck. Um, and probably, so, not the most, sorry, this is not one of those hype videos, but just stuff I want to talk about. But then, uh, um, probably the double, I hope one day that I could actually work with this company, um, which is uh, Dex in Taiwan. Uh, they're almost pretty much impossible to get a hold of. Um, I'm a huge Lotus and Hand fan. Um, they're kind of all over the place as well. I got normal cards right there, and um, they're mixed in between here. But uh, this is the duo, um, which I got from Carter's shop. Um, so, but yeah, I'm a huge, huge Lotus and Hand fan. But I'll come back to more decks. I don't want to like bore everybody out, but those are some of the ones I love and brands that I like. So, uh, hope you guys enjoy the video. Y'all out. Time, and now it's filming. All right. Jesus. All right.